In this video, I am going to show you how you can integrate LangChain with Vertex AI. Vertex AI is Google Cloud's machine learning, generative AI, or artificial intelligence managed service, which allows you to do a lot of things such as you can build with generative AI, you can extract, summarize, and classify data, you can train your own machine learning models or custom models, and you can also deploy your models for the production usage. And LangChain is one of the most popular framework which enables you to build large language model aware applications or generative AI applications. These applications are quite easy to build with LangChain and there are a lot of other things which you can do and I have a lot of videos on my channel where I, where I describe it in great detail as how to use LangChain. But in this video, I am just going to show you how you can quickly and easily integrate LangChain with Vertex AI and start using it from there. The first thing you need to do is to go to your Google Cloud or if you already have G Cloud installed on your local system, then go to your terminal and log into your Google Cloud by using G Cloud. If you don't know how to do it, I just did a video today on my channel where I describe in very simple words as how to install and configure the G Cloud, which is primarily a CLI uh, tool to connect to your Google Cloud. So let me take you to my G Cloud. So this is my uh, local terminal where I already have logged into my G Cloud. So I'm assuming that you already have G Cloud installed. You are already logged into your Google Cloud and you have set your project in Google Cloud. Now the second thing you need to do is to install LangChain dash CLI through pip. So I already have installed, but if you don't, just do pip install LangChain dash CLI and then it will install it on your local system. I already have installed it, so I'm just show, doing pip show lang chain dash CLI and you can see that I have the latest version installed. Let me clear my screen. Okay, that's good. Now, in order to run a template from Vertex CI in LangChain, all you need to do is to run this command. So in this command, what we are doing is we are scaffolding a LangServe REST API and we are adding the Chuck Norris template provided by Google using the following command. So once that's done, let's press enter. It will ask you if you want to install it, just press Y, press enter Y here and then press enter. And it is adding it from the GitHub repo, as you can see on your screen. It takes a bit of a time depending on your internet speed. So let's wait for it to finish. It will not take too long. So now it is installing a lot of stuff there. So let's wait for it to finish. Once that command will finish, it will create a new folder, my dash demo in your current directory. Go to that directory, open it in any editor of your choice. It could be even notepad. Then go to app directory and then open the server.py file as you can see on your screen. Here, replace line number 14 with these lines. These lines are simply importing the Vertex AI Chuck Norris template and then adding the routes. Then save it and now go back to your my demo directory in your terminal. Let me take you back to the terminal. This is our terminal. Sorry, let me clear the screen. There you go. So this is our terminal. Okay, now here, all we need to do is to run the application, which is LangChain Serve. LangChain and Serve, and press Enter. And what this will do, this is going to bring up the web server on localhost on port 8080. So make sure that port is open. So you can see that it is now starting and thanks service done application startup complete and let me go back to my browser and in the browser it should bring up something like this where uh, you can uh, play around with this length or playground and then it will generate some of the jokes so this is it guys this is how you integrate your length chain with your Vertex AI 
and you can play around with it and there are a lot of other uh, templates which you can get from google's website i'll also drop the link to the blog post from google's website which i have followed and you can do the same thanks for watching and i hope you liked it and if you like the content please consider subscribing to the channel thank you very much